vanished, disappeared in China. Unanswered questions. And how does a, a young man like that just disappear? There is a very good likelihood the North Koreans got him. A shocking new claim. David Snedden appears to be teaching English to the very supreme leader of North Korea. This is the kind of thing they do. He is the only American who has ever disappeared without a trace in China. That did not happen. We found evidence of where he had been on several stops far from the river. Confirmed that David had made it through the gorge with them and actually finished the trek back through the gorge. David went into the town, found this Korean restaurant, showed up three different times, and then disappeared. There is absolutely no evidence, but none, that David had any plans to disappear. It has been common practice for the North Koreans to abduct people with language skills. David Snedden was a very good speaker of both Korean and Chinese. That would have made him a likely target or at least a very desirable target. In many cases of abductions of foreign nationals by North Korea, these abductions were centered on Korean restaurants. A number of people have been abducted in the period right before National Day. It's a way of making a gift to the great dictator. Tonight, a Utah family has a little more hope. David Snedden이라는 사람이 북한에 있다.
김정일이 얘네들 그 영어 공부를 시켜오는 애들 하나 데리고 와라. 이렇게 지시를 내렸답니다. 그때부터 강제로 뛰었겠지. 그 한국 이름은 민봉수 그 다음에 그 부인은 김은혜 자식이 둘 있고 